Welcome to School Page and Zoom. Here is your question from Chemistry on Empirical Formula. The empirical formula of a compound is Option A. Simplest ratio of whole numbers of atoms in a compound. Option B. Complex ratio of fractional numbers of atoms in a compound. Option C. The ratio of number of atoms at the start of a reaction. And Option D. The complex ratio of whole numbers of atoms. A compound is a substance formed when two or more elements are chemically bonded together. Like for example, glucose. Glucose is a chemical compound formed by 6 carbon atoms, 12 hydrogen atoms and 6 oxygen atoms. It is represented by the formula C6H12O6 which is also the molecular formula of a compound. Molecular formula of a compound gives the actual number of atoms of each element present in the compound. Hence is considered as the true formula of a compound. An empirical formula is derived from the molecular formula and gives the simplest whole number ratio of the atoms of each element in that compound. Let us understand this by deriving the empirical formula of glucose. Empirical formula of glucose can be obtained by dividing the subscripts of glucose by greatest common factor. C6H12O6 is a molecular formula where the subscripts are 6, 12 and 6 which is divided by the greatest common factor 6. On dividing 6, 12 and 6 by 6 we get the ratio of 1 is to 2 is to 1. It simply means that carbon, hydrogen and oxygen are bonded with each other in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 1. Formula of glucose becomes C1H2O1 or it can also be written as CH2O. CH2O is the empirical formula of glucose. Now observe the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 1 which is nothing but the simplest whole number ratios of the elements present in that particular compound. Hence, the empirical formula of a compound is simplest ratio of whole numbers of atoms in a compound. Thank you for watching. For more videos, visit our website schoolpage.me.